Um, thanks to all the text messages and the emails I got. There was a 7-point to 10-point teaser involved in Pain Insider. The official record for them as of yesterday is 0, 1, and 2 minus 30 dimes. That will be the official record, and we might as well get to today's selections from them. And they had the uh, Boston Celtics on the first half line and got screwed by just about a point. And they also had a 7-point teaser tonight. So that will officially make them 032 minus 74 dimes on our official chart. Now, let's get to our winner. Oh, first of all, we want to make this clear. Tomorrow night, there will be no video. There will be no chart, no nothing. We will bring it up Sunday. I have double weddings tomorrow. First time in a while that I've had to do double weddings. And um, actually have to be up relatively early for me. And have a uh, two to seven wedding, and then a nine to like one-ish wedding. And um, there's a certain bill that needs to be paid, and uh, I need to do that. I swore I wasn't going to do double weddings again because it is brutal. It's basically ten hours on your feet, and um, th this needs to be done and taken care of. So I'm doing. It. There will be no video tomorrow night. So I apologize to anyone wanting to see it. I will get the chart up uh, with the video sometime Sunday during the football games because the Eagles do not play till late. So there will be no video tomorrow night. Nonetheless, our winner of the week, Top Shelf Chicago, where to 11:17 you can get all his plays for 45 bucks, and from now to and including the Super Bowl, 150 dollars. He went one and zero in the day plus 10 units. Ty Davis, sports investor, our biggest bankroll winner of the week ever. Uh, started off the week phenomenal, struggling a little bit now, goes 0-1, going to give back 11 dimes. Not too bad considering the bankroll he has, and he does have a special for you as well. His football plays are 50 bucks, mentioned probably help, or you can get every one of his plays till March 31st, 2009. That will cost you $100. Hey, if you got a few bucks laying around, I know the economy's brutal. Um, I might buy them both and compare. Did you see the numbers? I never realized the first Friday of every month you can get the unemployment numbers. In the month of October, 240,000 jobs were lost. Oh, man, this country is in worse shape than I thought. Jeez, no wonder the bars cut me a little bit. My God, I never dreamed of numbers like that. Nonetheless, let's get to the rest of our report. Betting as a business, 3-1 and one on the day, plus 112.5 units. The Basher, small play, but winner, 1-0, and o, plus 10 dimes. Bobby Clark Sports goes 1-1. One one. He's going to give back 800 bucks. Millionaire Picks goes 1-1, one one, plus 170 bucks. I say it all the time. If you break even... And you still are on the plus side, nice money management. Over the spread, 1-0, and out, adds 100 dimes to his bankroll. Pete James of Party Pete Sports, 1-2, minus 17.5 dimes. Primetime Sports Advisors, having a rough time of it, at least on Friday. I'm sure they'll bounce back tomorrow. 0-4, minus 32.5 units. Rock Hard Picks, 0-1, going to give back 40 dimes. Tony Bruno wins. Struggle a little bit, gets one today. Nice job and a nice dime play. 1 and 0 plus 50 dimes. WTW Sports goes 2 and 1 plus 180 units. However, they have put themselves out of winner of the week eligibility as they played 200 unit plays. As you know, for winner of the week, you can only take one day a week off. If you're just football, you got to play a minimum six games. You cannot win more than 100 dimes or 1,000 bucks. They did 200 units. They are out of winner of the week, but a good record still. Who is what and where are they at? Top Shelf Chicago, 2-1 and one plus 5 units. Ty Davis Sports Investor is 7-2 and two plus 594 dimes. Betting as a business, 7-3. and three. Nice week. Plus 239.5 units. Remember, you can head on. They're our newest handicapper. You can head on over there, sign up for a free account. You will get free picks if you sign up for that account. Not bad. Seven and three, and actually really good. Seven and three plus two hundred and thirty-nine point five units. 
The Basher, 3-1 week, plus 80 dimes. Bobby Clark Sports, 4-3, minus 230 bucks. Millionaire Picks, 4-1 on the week, plus 1,040 bucks. Over the spread is 3-3, three three, plus 6 dimes. Pete James of Polly Pete Sports, still struggling after last week. 3-5, minus 26 dimes. Payne Insider, official totals after all the other stuff went on. 3-5, three, three pushes, minus 80 dimes. Primetime Sports Advisors, 3-9, minus 66.5 units. Rock Hard Picks, 1-2, minus 50 dimes. Tony Bruno wins, 1-3, my, uh, minus 15.5 dimes. I guarantee you he will bounce back tomorrow. WTW Sports, 3-1, plus 280 units. Remember, he's not eligible for winner of the week after the 200-unit plays. Still looking for one more handicapper if you think you can pick games and pick winners. Email me, and you can take over one of the empty spots. Actually, the only empty spot left because of some billing issues that happened to uh, happen. And all I can say about that is people make a commitment to pay on a certain payment arrangement and then choose to not do so. That may show character. It wasn't a trial basis. It was a pay this, pay that. Assume your own opinions. I will leave names out. We will not be here tomorrow night, as I told you. Double weddings. And it's going to be a long friggin' day. The number one sports monitor on the internet and your sports betting internet community, parlayhelp.com. New intro is coming soon. I'm waiting for a banner for a couple of guys, and then I'll put it all together. We'll see everyone probably Sunday afternoon sometime, get the Saturday report up. We will be back Sunday night and obviously Monday night for our best video of the week, the WOW. And usually when somebody wins one of the week, you guys, my users, get a special. Enjoy your weekend. Partyhelp.com.